Hey YouTube, Michelle Media here with another Dollar Tree haul. If you see me wearing the same clothes as my last video, that's because I did this in sequence, okay? I was planning on doing it the next morning, but I went ahead and found everything that I wanted to show you guys and that I don't want you to miss out. So the sooner I get to air it for you guys on YouTube, the sooner you guys get to go out and look for these things before they're gone. Okay, so let's go right into it here. I got a set of these. I finally found the blue ones, guys. These uh, kind of a pebble texture little vase with the uh, shell top here. I believe these come off, yep. Very sturdy. And uh, I just found these in the shell. I believe they had starfish and some other ones, but I got three of these blue ones that were left in the shell. Okay, and I got a set of three of these clear ones with the starfish. Look how beautiful these are. Oh my goodness. I may have hauled these before or similar ones. I can't remember. I've got some bottles that I have yet to unpack from months back. So I think they were just similar. And either way, um, these are so good. They can be used for so many things. I'm just gonna use them as is, put on a shelf or a mantle or something. Nevertheless, grab these, okay? Especially the blue ones, guys, they go really, really fast. So make sure you go out there and look for them right away. And of course, the quintessential Stars and Stripes hats. I got the ones that they had left. I got like half a dozen of them. I want to give them out on 4th of July. And um, they work perfectly well. I have a really thick uh, ponytail when I put it up, and it worked fine with me. So make sure you get some of those while they have them in stock. Okay, this is something that you guys are going to love. <clears throat> this is, in my previous video, I mentioned these were uh, Matchbox, but no, they're Hot Wheels. The Stars and Stripes series. In time for 4th of July, look at that. Look at this, some of these are old model cars. Okay, here is the, um, good Lord, I don't know. Oh, the Plymouth Duster. Okay. This one is the uh, 70 Chevy Camaro. Look at that. And all of them have stars and stripes, red, white, and blue on them somewhere to some capacity. This one's got on top of the roof. This one does too. Oh my God. You've just got to go to the store and see if you, your series is there. And believe it or not, I think there are about seven or eight of them. And uh, I got each one of them and they had one of each left and that's it. So I was lucky enough to grab all of them. And uh, <clears throat> those two. And here is the um, 68 Hemi Barracuda. You guys are gonna love them. And what about Father's Day, guys? Grab them, grab them while you can. And here is the 68 El Camino. Oh my goodness. My husband knows I want an El Camino or what do you call those other ones? The Rancheros? <laughs> Yeah, and here's the other one. There's four of them. And here is the Chevy Blazer, four by four. Oh my goodness. For you guys and men with the uh, big trucks. Look at that, okay. And here is the AMC Javelin AMX. Okay, and all of them, like I said, are part of the Stars and Stripes series that they have right now. So if you don't go out there by this week, and chances are they'll be hard to find because, you know, 4th of July coming up and people grabbing them as soon as they see them. Now, um, let's see, there's a couple more. Here is the 71 Plymouth Hemi Cuda. Look at that. Oh, I love these. I want to put them up in my husband's man cave, so those are just fabulous. Okay. And there are two more. This is the uh, 64 Pontiac GTO. A lot of you guys love that one, I know. Right, cameraman? Right. Louder. Right. Okay, and here is the uh, 68 Mercury Cougar. Oh my goodness, so cool. And I just got this one because it was so cool looking. This um, Mad Props plane. That was just too cool to leave behind. That wasn't part of the series, but it was too cool to leave behind. So let's see, it's a total of one, two, three, four, six. 
three, four, six, seven, eight. Total of nine stars and stripes. So I think I got them all. So go out there. Finally found the wheels. Last time I only found the peace signs. Now I found the wheels. So I got four of them. Oh, look, I was so lucky to find them. So make sure you look all over because sometimes people will leave these in other aisles if they're running on a low supply for the store. They'll decide not to take them and you'll find be lucky enough to find them in a different aisle. So keep your eye out, okay? Keep your eye out for that. Alrighty. Um, Let's see here. The ear pod containers, I had to get myself the pineapple, okay? Had to do that. Got a couple more things to show you guys. These bookends are fabulous. Oh my goodness, they have different laser cut uh, inspiration sayings or words on the side. This is the metal, typical, you know, L-shaped metal uh, bookend. This one says, inspire you can read it okay and this one here says read so i got a pair of these because these are close enough to my favorite color it's kind of like a uh, aqua bluish i don't know what you would call it but nevertheless it's pretty color so i got that um I don't know what these look like so maybe i'll open them up now and see got some fans fourth of july fans to show you guys and i'll open up this one here and show you look how pretty look at that oh what fabulous view. i've got two other designs so they come in a package of three so that's a pretty good bargain little outside is plastic and oh for a buck you cannot beat that that's a good bargain right there and this is a notebook that comes with three uh little pads okay and it comes with a pen here i'm sure it has like black ink on it beautiful little bee theme look at that oh, it says believe in yourself how oh, great okay and so far, I've only been able to find one, the white camera. A little porcelain or ceramic camera. I love that. And I went ahead and grabbed myself some of these ut uh, utility uh, baskets. I can always use those. I already have them in red, but uh, I thought white would be a good thing to have. Okay, just a couple more items before we end. Now, you guys, please keep an eye out for these. They have new numbers and letters in stainless steel. You can get the N through Z's, 13 pieces. Okay, they're stainless steel, they're tiny uh, letters. Okay, and you've got the A through M, 13 pieces, you know that, so. And then you've got the bigger size letters in 10 pieces, one through zero. The little fat letters. Oh my goodness. Make sure you keep an eye out for that, okay? And of course the little trucks. You've got two styles, okay? You've got the one with the uh, wooden bed top. Okay, the little slats that go in the top. And then you've got this one without. So you've got those. And let's see, I think I might have a couple. Oh, yeah. One more thing. These arrows, look at these fabulous um, uh, magnetic arrows you can put on anything, you know. Just this decor to hold a uh, piece of paper, a note or something up. I love these. These are so great. Okay, guys, well, that is the end. Let me just check this tub here. Make sure I didn't miss anything. I believe... Oh, I almost forgot. Hold on here. Let me get this here. I found some really great pens, guys. Let me see. I've got one, two. They came in several colors. I 
I don't have all of them here, but nevertheless, these are <clears throat> some pens that you can find in a sequence body and they come in different color inks. You press, you know, those old timey pens from the 70s that you press down each color. Well, this one is in a purple case. This one is in a green and they came in uh, other colors as well. I don't have them with me right now, but oh, they're so cool. Look at how shiny and I love the fat pens. I just love them. You have to look for these because these are actually going quick. They, did, they didn't have very much on the peg. So uh, if you see them, grab them because I'm not sure. You never know. Dollar Tree that they may or may not bring them back. So guys, that is all for today. I hope you enjoyed this haul and let me know what else you would like for me to look out for or what you have hauled already that maybe I did as well or anything you would like to discuss. I'd love to hear from you guys. So make sure you subscribe, give me a thumbs up and uh, just uh, chime in anytime you want, okay? So until my next video, I will see you guys later. Bye and thanks for stopping by.